In this video, we are going to see how to use 3 input AND gate 4073. So let's get started. For 073, it is 3 input AND gate IC. Let's have a look on the pin diagram. It has 14 pins. Pin number 7 is the ground pin and pin 14 is VCC. The supply voltage can be from 5 volt to plus 18 volt. It has 3 gates in it. Gate 1, 2 and 3. The gate 1, its output is pin number 6 and the inputs are pin 5, pin 4 and pin 3. Its input pins are pin 8, pin 2 and pin 1 and its output is pin 9. The output of this gate 3, it is pin 10. The inputs are pin 11, 12 and 13. So these are 3 gates, gate 1, 2 and 3. These 5 pins are input. It is output, input and it is pin 9 and 10 are output and 11, 12, 13 are the inputs. So this is the pin diagram. Now we will verify this IC on the breadboard. For this we will use only gate number 1. We can write the 3 input and get as A, B and C and Y is the output. So mathematically we can write a dot b dot c equal to y as it has three inputs so the total combination will be 8 2 cube it is 8 so it is starts from 0 0 0 5 6 and 7 so these are the 8 inputs and as it is a dot b dot c so 0 0 0 means it is 0 if any input is 0 then the output will be 0 till this it is 0 and only this input we have 3 1 so the output will be 1 so this will be our truth table and we have to verify this on the breadboard so this is the get 1 and as we know it is pin number 6 and these are pin number 3, 4 and 5. We will provide input with a switch. Other side of the switch will connect high signal that is plus 5 volt and to see the output we will connect an LED. Its value 220 ohms. And we have to connect pull down resistor with the inputs and I have already explained why should we connect the pull down resistor link in the description below the value is 10 kilo ohms and to see the input we can connect an LED to all the inputs so this is the circuit now we'll see this on the breadboard I see 4073 putting the switch one side of the switch is connected to the plus VCC Pin 14 is connected to the plus VCC. Pin number 7 is connected to the ground. Now putting the LEDs, the other set of the switch. Putting the pull down resistor. For gate 1, that is as we are connecting the gate 1, so pin number 3, 4, and 5 will be our inputs. Putting the output LED. Positive pin is connected with pin number 6 and with the negative pin I have to connect a 220 ohms resistor. Okay. And with this other 3 also. With the same side that is the output side we have to connect the inputs. So these switches are connected to pin number 3, 4 and 5. 
and now I'm connecting the positive rail and the negative rail okay so connection is completed now connecting the power supply here it is negative and the positive zero 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 means zero 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 one it is zero For 111, we are getting the output. So this is how this IC works. So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.